Kids are gonna get animal bites and animal scratches, and here's what you need to know. Uh, common are cat scratches and cat bites. You know, you're breaking up a cat fight. Well, uh, cat scratches can cause something called cat scratch disease, where if you get a scratch on your arm, a lymph node a few weeks later grows painful and swollen underneath your uh, armpit, or on your foot and the lymph node grows up in your groin area. So watch out for that. Dog bites are bad, they can get infected. Uh, and of course, if there's a stray dog and a sick dog, you've got to worry about rabies. That's not common, but you need to call animal control. Puncture wounds are worse than open wounds. An open wound lets the bacteria out a little bit and can be cleansed. A puncture wound looks less bad, but it really is worse because it inoculates the germ down underneath the skin where they just grow. Now, there's other animal bites that you don't need to worry too much about. I got bit by a mouse once and my parents freaked out, but that's not a big deal. Main thing is to get your tetanus shot up to date, cleanse the area, and if it's a puncture wound, watch it real carefully for infection.